The false valve maneuver increases the intraspinal pressure, which in turn can exacerbate neuropathies or radicular pain. According to Wayne et al. from the year 2003, it has a sensitivity of 22% and a specificity of 94% in the detection of cervical radicular syndrome. It can therefore be used to increase the post-test chance of having cervical radiculopathy, but still has a rather weak clinical utility as a standalone test. To perform the test, have your patient in sitting position. Then ask your patient to take a deep breath and hold the breath while attempting to exhale over two to three second period with gradually increasing force. Some people might find it easier to blow against the back of their hand or think of bearing down as in performing a toilet procedure or equalizing ear pressure during diving. This test is positive if the patient's arm pain or paresthesia is reproduced.